All right, so we want to figure out the inverse of this function. So y is equal to um, x squared minus 4 over 2x squared. Swap them, so we get x is equal to y squared minus 4 over 2y squared. All right, so 2y squared x equals y squared minus 4. Get the y's on one side. So we're going to have 2y squared x minus y squared equals negative 4. Pull out the y squared, so I get, oops, 2x minus 1 equals negative 4. So y squared is equal to negative 4 over 2x minus 1. Take square root. Well, first, I'm going to just, this is the same thing as 4 over 1 minus 2x. Okay, square root, so y is going to be equal to the square root of 4 over 1 minus 2x. So here's our inverse. That's x. Okay, um, plug and check. Now, technically, you're supposed to do it both ways, but I'm only going to do it one. f of f of negative 1 of x, so I'm going to put in a square root of 4 over 1 minus 2x squared minus 4 over 2 times 4 minus 1 over 2x. This radical should be down, and this is squared. So this becomes... Yeah. 4 over 1 minus 2x minus 4 over 2 times 4 1 minus 2x. Okay, so this becomes 4 uh, minus 4 plus 8x over 1 minus 2x over um, 8 over 1 minus 2x. These cancel out. This cancels out. We get 8x over 8, which reduces down to x. So that proves, at least for f of f of negative 1, it's equal to x. And I'm pretty sure f of negative 1 of f of x equals x also. So our inverse is the square root of 4 over 1 minus 2x. That's it.